Hey YouTube, I got another video review for you today. This one's from a company by the name of Antop. This is their HD smart panel antenna. Uh, this The model number on this one is the AT-800SBS. And this one has the, uh, the new uh, smart boost system. Man, I couldn't get it out. I was sitting there thinking about it. But uh, anyways, and what this is, is the new um, amplifier that's adjustable. It comes with a little adjustment knob here where you can t turn the gain up and down. And uh, this box also acts as a splitter where, let's say, this goes to your antenna. This goes out to your antenna. And then this one goes to your TV. Or this one could go to another TV or an FM um, stereo. Or you, you could do, uh, let's say you've got an entertainment system and you've got a TV on there. This would go to your TV. And let's say on the same entertainment system you've got sitting there, uh, you've got a FM stereo. <clears throat> so you could plug them both in there and they work simultaneously. And uh, like I said, it has the adjustable gain and, um, you know... Uh, it comes with uh, the antenna, as you can see, and I've already got the, the little um, VHF uh, rods here already screwed in, so you can kind of get an idea of what it looks like. And uh, it's a real simple installation to hook this thing up. Uh, it comes with everything that you would need. It comes with the mounting hardware. And then the bracket is, bracket is already attached on the back of the the uh, antenna, so you know you can you can mount it like uh, with just these little hangers right here, or you can use the the uh, that little hardware, the little U-shaped mount to mount it on a pole. Um, it's got a lot of different mounting options, so you know I'm sure there's one for you. Now it. it I have it sitting right now with the uh, optional uh, indoor mount, but this comes off. So all you got to do is just pull, mash a little tab down on the back and push down on it, and this comes off. So, you know, when it's mounted outside, the little base uh, is not going to be on it. You don't have to leave it on there. You can if you wanted to. It's not going to hurt anything. But uh, anyways, I've just got mine mounted on the... On the base just to do the video and everything um, it comes with everything that you need for the installation it comes with uh, 40 foot of RG6 cable uh, I believe this is RG6 well it says a uh, coax cable I would assume that it is RG6 but it's 40 foot of cable here and then it has the little weatherproof boot one thing that I will add on this cable, it's not solid core cable. It is copper clad cable. So like I've said in some of the other videos, if, if you've got a channel that you really want that's not coming in absolutely perfect, uh, you could probably switch this, uh, this cheaper cable out to a pure copper cable. And, you know, it's not that much more money. And, you know, it might help you get in one of those hard to reach channels. Not saying that it will, I'm just saying, you know, it could. And it also comes with two other uh, pieces, of, uh, five foot pieces of uh, coax cable. It comes with your power adapter to power the uh, amplifier. And then it comes with this little device. And what this is for is for your um, FM stereo. Some of them um, might have these little uh, spring connectors where you've got the red and black and then you mash the little tab down and it's, it's spring loaded and you just put them in there like speaker wires and then it hooks right here to this connector to uh your coax and as you can see this end screws into into here and then this uh plugs into your stereo and then this end would plug into your your booster and uh this end right here would plug into your outdoor antenna, or you can leave it indoors if you want. Um, this is an indoor-outdoor antenna. 
So, uh, anyways, guys, uh, I'm going to go ahead and switch it over and get this thing hooked up. And, and we're going to see just how many channels uh, this thing will pick up. It says that it has an 85-mile range. Uh, one thing that I do like about this antenna, before I, I go ahead and hook it up, is it does uh, have a 4G LTE filter. So your cell phone um, shouldn't give you any problems as far as, you know, um, interfering with the uh, signal. So it is what it is. We're fixing to hook it up and see. All right, guys. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use the RG6 uh, pure copper cable that I already have, um, already installed. So I really didn't need Antop's uh, cable. But uh, I wanted to show you one little tool that they include in their little kit that is just really, really handy. It's basically just a little miniature wrench that you can use on your uh, coax connection. And what it does, it just helps you tighten it up. And the cool thing about this little wrench is it won't let you over tighten it because it's made out of plastic. And you can see that I've got it hooked on there. And if you try to over tighten it, it just spins. So that's a really, really handy tool if you're trying to connect that coax cable in a tight uh, spot. And, um, you know, anybody that's uh, tried to, to connect coax cable, um, it kind of hurts your, your fingers trying to tighten it up sometimes. So that little wrench that they supplied is uh, definitely a nice little touch. All right, guys, I'm about to uh, hook up the uh, adjustable amplifier, and uh, I just wanted to uh, give a, just a, my feedback on uh, this. Uh, uh, I noticed that, as you can see, the way that the uh, plastic fits together is a little bit off right there, and uh, when I got this uh, amplifier, I noticed that this coax cable or not the cable, the uh, the little uh, piece sticking out right here, the little coax piece, uh, it's on there crooked. So I, I don't know if it's, uh, you know, just a bad uh, part that come out or what, but I'm sure um, they need to tighten up on their quality control. So I, uh, I, I do want to bring that to their attention in this review so anyways um i'm sure it works just fine uh they just need to to uh check that out before they send it to customers but anyways um let's get it hooked up and i'll do a channel scan and we'll get going all right guys i got the antenna sitting in the window and uh this is in my living room and uh sorry i've got such a mess but uh anyways uh, I've got it hooked up to the TV and the uh, stereo down below, and I was able to pick up 15 FM stations before I could only get five. And I'm not saying that all 15 come in crystal clear. There's a little fuzz on them, and uh, it does help if you adjust the amplifier uh, with the knob a little bit. But uh, the amount of channels that I was able to get versus the little bitty um wire that they use for and that comes with the uh stereo that they supply you with um for an antenna um it's a big difference uh like i said i was only able to get five and now i'm able to get 15 so that is a really really big jump i'm fixing to do a channel scan we'll see how many channels i pick up all right guys you can see I just did a channel scan and it said that I got 42 channels. Sorry, the volume was turned up. I had to turn it down. But you can see that it's uh, 42 channels. And I will say that I am doing this live with you guys. Uh, I'm watching it the same as, as, as I'm videoing it right now. And uh, so. 42 channels is really, really good. Now, I will say that this window is pointing north. And I had a similar end top antenna that didn't have the uh, smart uh, amplifier uh, in my bedroom. 
and I had it pointing towards most of all the TV channels, and I'll go ahead and tell you my zip code. My zip code is 37323, and if you uh, look on antennaweb.org or TV Fool uh, or uh, Antop's website, uh, you can punch in your zip code, and it tells you which direction the uh, TV signals are coming from. And so most of mine are coming from the west. And like I said, this antenna here is pointing towards the north. But in my bedroom, uh, like I said, I had a, a similar um, Antop antenna in my bedroom. And I was able to pick up 51 channels. Now, granted, uh, that antenna was pointed towards the west. So, of course, you're going to get more uh, channels. So, uh, I guarantee you, you would at least get 51 channels with this uh, antenna if it was in my bedroom right now. So uh, I'll go ahead and show you just how clear the, uh, let me go ahead and try to get this off the screen here. There we go. You can see just how clear the picture is on all these. Man, that's pretty amazing. I mean, it sure does beat paying a, a cable bill every month. And you know as well as I do, they keep going up on their prices. And, uh, you know, it's just going to continue to get higher and higher. So um, <laughs> why not get get it for free? I mean, most of the channels that you get on over-the-air broadcast are your, your classic, you know, your... Your Fox and ABC, NBC, CBS. So, you know, you're pretty much getting a lot of the same channels that you would get with um, with uh, cable, you know. But then there's some good movie channels like this one here. Uh, this is the Bounce channel. Uh, they show a lot of good movies on there. Then you've got the Escape channel. There's a lot of crime stuff on there. And then if you're, you know, into Westerns, there you go. you got a, a Grit TV and, uh, you know, guys, there's just a lot to offer with uh, cutting the, the, the cord and, and just going to an over-the-air broadcast. And you got to keep in mind a lot of these channels are in HD, you know. So definitely check it out. I don't think you'll be um, disappointed. Uh, one thing I will say, um, I told you that I had it hooked up to the stereo there on the bottom. Uh, I would play you the stations, but I don't want uh, YouTube sending me a thing saying, hey, uh, you've uh, got a copyright infringement thing um, going against your account for playing music or something by an artist. So you'll just have to take my word for it uh, that I did get 15 channels when I only normally got five. So anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. You guys get the picture and... Uh, Anyways, make sure you like and subscribe. I review a lot of different TV antennas. Uh, I've got a lot of other videos with different antennas, so just check them out. And uh, I appreciate you watching. Thank you.